Yes, today we're going to learn about reactions between metal and water. The general equation is metal plus water gives off metal hydroxide and hydrogen. But do all metals react the same way? Let's find out. Lithium moves slowly and fizzes, like the boring, not that reactive metal it is. Sodium is better, more reactive, moves faster, and fizzes faster than lithium. Potassium is the best. Not only does it move quickly and fizzes, but also catches on pretty, pretty fire. But now, what's the science be behind all this? Let's find out. Lithium contains three electrons. It has two shells with one electron on the outer shell and two in the first shell. Sodium has 11 electrons with three shells. The outer shell has one electron. Atoms are at their most stable when they have eight electrons on their outer shell. With only one, it is unstable. This helps explain why all metals are reactive. But potassium is the most reactive. Potassium has 19 electrons with four shells. There's one electron on its outer shell, therefore it's unstable. Also, the distance between the last electron and the nucleus is greater. Further away from the positive influence of the nucleus, it's more easily lost. Base, top, box, potassium, long, safety. What does potassium look like on a bigger scale? Let's find out! 